Hello, welcome back to Bureaucrat. Today I have an inspired look for you. It is kind of like editorial. I think that's what you call it. This is what it looks like. It's not tell um it is a lot of blush and a lot of contour. And basically the contour is made with a blush, if that makes sense, and then almost nothing on the eyes and just like a nudish lip. And I figured what better way to do this look than with my new uh, sleek makeup trio thing, whatever you call it. Uh, so you have as you can see, bronzer, highlighter, and blush, and yeah, I haven't really used it. I tried it, I think I tried the highlighter out and the blush, but that's about it. So I don't know what the contour looks like, I don't know if it's going to look good or not. And yeah, we're just going to do this. Also, it also has a bit of, it also has a bit of explanation here, what to do. Um, so first off, you start with bronzer. Now, this is not really a bronzing powder, it's more like a contour powder. I'm going to make it work so... Let me zoom in. So I think this is good. I don't know how much I'll so have off. Okay. I'm a bit scared. So maybe I shouldn't have washed my hair before doing this. This is really nice. I want the powder, like, I'm so happy that this is the light version, I'm so happy that this actually um, fits a bit better. Okay, and then the other side too. Like even if you don't tap off the brush, you still don't have enough on it. It's very, very buildable. So does that kind of look the same? I think so. Then we're gonna do blush. Um, I don't know if this has a name. A shimmer blush. It doesn't have a name, but uh, we're going very, very heavy with this. Even like almost into the eye. I'm gonna use the same. Oh, okay. Okay. I'm a bit scared. Like it's not as. In the camera, it looks really intense, but in reality, it's just not that intense. It also has shimmer to it. So I don't even know if I should put hard at all. What? So I'll go on a bit of my eyes here. This. And granted, this is very editorial. Like, this is not for... I mean, if you want to go out like this on a daily basis, go. Literally, go. No one, no one is stopping you. And I feel like that will be such a look. Also, the eyes here a bit. I actually kind of like this. And the color is nice, honestly. It, I don't think it's really necessarily what it looks like in the pen, because in the pen it looks like a, a coral color, and then on my cheeks it looks very pink. I don't know, can, can you tell that? Mm. I don't know. Blending this in. Even going in with the contour color a little bit. I feel like she's even more on. She had a lot on like the cheekbones. You know what I mean? It kind of brings me back to my look that I did for uh, the collab with Rachel the Great, or Rachel. Because um, I was full of blush. And I really like that, honestly. Okay, it's going to... Technically, I don't need highlight now, because this is very hard idea, but I'm, I'm just going to apply it, just for the sake of it. Oh god. I like this. 
Oh wow, I love this. Um, let me just quickly get some mascara on. And fun fact, after this video, I will actually do a um, what's that? The cleanser, the Omoro Vicha cleanser that I have. So that will actually work nicely too. Also, I did some errands today, and I went out just with concealer and lipstick. I didn't even have mascara on. It was a bit weird. Um, because usually mascara is the only thing I wear, but I figured why not? It'd be a slight change. Mm. Then for lips, I have a color pop one, which is almost empty. Um, Brink. I hope this is kind of the right color, and I hope it's covering the other color that I have on. I truly love these lippy sticks. Lippy, lippy sticks. The thing is, as soon as there's not that much left, it's hard to get an even layer because, like, I don't know if you can see it here, but on top there's nothing left, and it's just a little, little bit here, and it's just like you're basically scraping off the color that you just applied with the plastic that's already exposed. You know what I mean? I actually kind of like this. I wouldn't go out like this. I like it. Maybe, maybe I was lucky because the blush is not too intense. I mean, in the camera it looks really heavy, but in reality, it's not. In reality, it's like a mixture between blush and bronzer. Like it's not as in you know what I mean. It's not as intense. I wouldn't go out like this, but I like it. You know what? Let me just apply a bit more. Because why not? Again, a bit eyes there. I actually really enjoy this. So that was it. I hope you enjoyed this look. Um, it is very straightforward. Um, I mean, I would not. I don't know if I would put this out. I mean, with my hair covering it, maybe, but on that, I don't know, probably not. But, you know, it looks nice. I feel like it would look nice on various skin colors. You know, with the white blush, it would look good. So I feel like if you're really in for it, go for it. Honestly, I think it's pretty cool. So it might not look completely the same because I'm not good at contouring because I never know where to exactly put this. And maybe I should watch a video. Maybe I should make a video. I don't know. So, I hope you enjoyed this. Anyway, let me know what you think. Is this too much in your face for you or would you wear this? Yeah. And let me know what else, what other looks you would like to see. And yeah, I'm gonna wash it up now because I have to try the face cleanser. So anyway, uh, if you enjoyed this video, give me a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel if you're not already, and see you next video.